A true grease monkey. Get under the hood and get your hands dirty in our simulated mechanics shop. Hello, human. This is an accurate simulation of Auto Mechanic. Oh, you gotta help me, human. I took my dad's car out last night with my friends, and now it's a mess. He's gonna kill me! Okay, this won't be too bad. Just clear off those branches for starters. That, uh, novelty air freshener looks incriminating. Better remove that, too. I just realized he's totally gonna know I used the car because the mileage counter. Can you do something? <laughs> Classic. I used to do this all the time when I was a kid. Just throw the car in reverse and put the pedal to the metal. in the trunk. You think you could get rid of that too? Uh, okay, great. Just do anything you gotta do. Just bill me when you're done. I still have my dad's credit card, so... Oh, thanks, human. I'll get this squared away uh, later. You're the best.
Yo, I just inherited this car from my rich uncle. You gotta help me make it look as awesome as I am. Pick out a paint color that really reflects my personality. Alright, interesting choice. Let's make this car look a little more sick. Hang something cool on the inside there. Something that expresses who I am. Solid choice. I feel that. I'm all about the cosmetics, human. You gotta stand out. I got this custom piece of hardware off the internet. Why don't you throw it on there for me? Yeah, right on the tailpipe. Yo, my hood's looking empty. You gotta help me spice it up with some custom bling. Nice! This thing is looking seriously sick! What is this? A bill? <laughs> I'll get my dad to take care of this. Every year we have a float in the local parade. We get to decorate this thing with a bunch of thrifty little pots and build a mayor for it. It's great. So let's give this thing the works. How about a fresh coat of paint? Don't 
those circular platforms on the corner are where we can display some parts. Fill them up with stuff you want to showcase. I mean, look, uh, look, I don't want to get into an argument with you about it, but it is the highest section. Yeah, you know, I, you know what? I, I, it nice, is nice. Highest, I'm now, uh, I'm what's a float without some dangling bits? Attach some stuff on the sides. I, on those little pegs. Well, I'm trying to tell you, Buster, that the ceiling or the top of the car is the highest section of the car. Now, you know, you know, you, you're getting me real upset. I'm going to have to kick you out of here if you're going to keep up this sort of attitude. <laughs> Some more on the back there, too. The radio, car radio, W er, one zero 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 one one zero FM radio. We're talking cars today. My guest Henry. This looks great. We're gonna get so much money from the mayor. Drop it when you're done, and we'll send it out. Parades were celebratory events where humans drove slow processions of decorated vehicles in a line. You know, it's probably the definite. Hello, human. I recently purchased this car to promote my new smoothie business. I was told it was a lemon, so I thought it would be great. I don't understand what's wrong with it. It's making a sound like... Could you take a look? Lemons everywhere. We'll need to do some serious de-lemoning on this vehicle.
it's looking better. This is literally Feel free to drop the vehicle <laughs> when you feel it's unlemony enough. I'm going to have this passed off to my personal accountant to be taken care of. Have a highly functional day, human. decorate my car with some debris. Following a marriage ceremony, it was an ancient human tradition to attach garbage to the back of their vehicles for attention. Debris equals love. Put it inside, put it outside, put it everywhere. <laughs> 